In this problem, we're told if 3.8 meters cubed of a gas initially at STP is placed under a pressure of 3.2 atmospheres, the temperature of the gas rises to 38 degrees Celsius, what is the volume? So in this case, what we're going to be doing is solving for the volume. And basically what we're given is two uh, different phases of the gas. And so the first part, there's going to be a pressure, there's going to be a volume, and there's going to be a temperature. And we know that the, uh, the pressure, the volume, and the temperature is going to equal to the pressure uh, the volume and the temperature at the end. So this is the formula we have here, P1V1 over T1 equals P2V2 over T2. And what we're doing is solving for the volume of the second state. So uh, what we need to do is just find the rest, right? So we need P1, we need V1, we have T1, or need T1 and P2 and T2. So let's just start with what they give us. So they give us, they say if 3.8 meters cubed, so they're giving us the initial volume. So volume one equals 3.8 meters cubed, is initially at STP. STP just means standard temperature and pressure. So standard temperature and pressure, or standard pressure, is one atmosphere. And then standard temperature is just 273.15 Kelvin. So we've got the pressure, we've got the volume, and we've got the temperature. Now at uh, the second, uh, second part, we know it's going to be at a pressure of 3.2 atmospheres. So 3.2 atmospheres. And then they tell us the gas is going to rise to 38 degrees Celsius. But when we do this, we need to make sure our temperature is in Kelvin, not Celsius. So to fix that, we have to add 273.15. So just keep that in mind, and then this will become now uh, Kelvin. And so uh, now we have everything. We just got to solve for V2. So solving for V2, we can multiply both sides by T2, and then just divide by P2, right? And so what you're going to get is V2 is equal to V1 times uh, P1 over P2, and then multiply by T2 over T1. And so keep in mind, the units for uh, pressure isn't going to make a difference because it's in uh, atmospheres and they're just going to cancel. But since our volume is in meters cubed, our answer is going to be in meters cubed. So solving for V2, we just want to plug in V1, which is 3.8. P1 is going to be one atmosphere. You want to divide that by 3.2. And then T2 is going to be uh, 38 plus 273.15. And then you're going to want to divide that by 273.15. And so now we're gonna now what you're gonna do is just go ahead and plug this in. So you're gonna do 3.8, you multiply that by one divided by 3.2, then multiply it by 38 plus 273.15 divided by 273.15. And so when you go ahead and do that, you're gonna get V2. And so in this case, V2 is equal to 1.3527. So I'm just going to round to 1.35. Keep in mind earlier, I said the units for V1 are meters cubed. So these units just cancel, right? Because they're just on top of each other. And so meters cubed is meters cubed. So meters cubed, 1.35 meters cubed. That's going to be uh, the volume. So this right here is going to be your answer. And hopefully you found this useful.